My dear brothers and sisters, so uh, in the gospel today, we hear or we uh, all learned again about our Lord appearing to the disciples. Nagpakita siya muli sa uh, mga disipulo. At ginawa niya ito para ma-confirm na siya po ay uh, nabuhay na maguli. That he resurrected to uh, tell them that uh, he really rose from the dead. And not only that, he wanted to strengthen their faith so that uh, in the coming days, they will go out and do their work of uh, preaching uh, the uh, resurrected uh, Jesus Christ. In our life, my dear brothers and sisters, there are indeed uh, times when we need also the help of God to uh, strengthen our faith, especially during this time of uh, this uh, pandemic caused by this, uh, um, <clears throat> this new uh, virus that is a variant. So many people are suffering, and not only sufferings, but uh, many are dying. I remember these uh, uh, doctors, two doctors, uh, who work as one of the frontliners in uh, a hospital in Cebu. And they were uh, giving service uh, to the uh, patients who were down with COVID. And um, they must have been exposed to the uh, uh, patients. And uh, what happened was the wife, uh, Helen, a doctor also, well, she contracted the sickness. And so she had to be quarantined. But you know what happened? The husband was also infected by this virus. And when the wife was looking for the husband, the nurse did not tell her that the husband was in the lower floor, that she was also uh, quarantined because of uh, this virus. At alam niyo po ang nangyari, nakakalungkot, namatay si Helen, yung asawa. At pagkatapos ng ilang araw, yung kanyang uh, asawang doktor ay namatay din. So for the children, they were really wondering, how come that God took both of our parents? How come that God did not have mercy on them? How come that uh, a two of them had to, uh, had to uh, die? So, they were asking questions regarding the goodness and the mercy of God. My dear brothers and sisters, indeed, there are really difficulties in, in life, and especially this time. Meron naman pong uh, iba dyan. Alam natin, uh, many are depressed not only depressed but distressed also. And why? Because many are suffering from economic crisis. Siguro yung mga may mga tao dyan, o mga pamilya that are well-to-do. But most of our people who are not well-to-do really 
uh, find it difficult to uh, make uh, both ends meet to really uh, uh, have enough enough uh, money for the family sustenance at dito po nagkakaroon ng kalungkutan at pag-aaway ng mga mag-asawa hindi lang pag-aaway kundi mga karahasan na nang nangyayari sa isa't isa at uh, pati yung mga bata you know in late I read in the newspaper there were children at the age of five the age of nine who committed suicide why? Because the parents were always quarreling over, over the lack of money. Dahil wala huwag trabaho yung lalaki. So you see, my dear brothers and sisters, this and other uh, problems, this and other, uh, other hardships, that we they are we are experiencing this indeed we should not think of something that is uh, violent we should not think about uh, you know giving up or getting discouraged but rather we should also go to our lord turn to our lord and ask for help and maybe not only to our Lord, but to St. Jude, the saint of the impossible. You know, uh, there is this um, pilot. Uh, he was a cargo pilot. And what happened was uh, they were retrenched. Yung policy na no work, no pay. At um, sabi niya, paano ang aking pamilya? How will, how will I support them? I have no job now. Pero alam po ninyo, itong uh, batang ito ay uh, nag-isip kung ano ang magagawa niya para magkaroon ng income for the family and for their needs. And, you know, um, he was asked to be a motorcycle driver to deliver food uh, from house to house. Para bang yung delivery boy ng, or man uh, ng grab. At um, sabi niya, mas mabuti na ito, mayroon akong uh, trabaho at uh, matutulungan ko ang aking pamilya. And so, sabi niya, at nanalangin din sa Panginoon na Lord, tulungan mo ako. At yung, uh, yung kasabihan na nasa tao ang gawa, nasa Diyos ang awa. And because of this, he was able to earn money for the family. So, dear brothers and sisters, what is important, and this man, for example, did something in order to, uh, to help his family, in order to give life to his family. And that we should do instead of getting depressed and that uh, we get discouraged and that we forget even to ask the Lord for help. And maybe for those who are really uh, so desperate, a lumapit po tayo kay St. Jude Tadeus. So uh, let us pray, therefore, and think of ways and means that will help us in order to solve our problems and also that we go to God and ask for His help. 
Sabi nga ng ating Panginoon, kayong lahat na napapagal at naghihirap, lumapit kayo sa akin at kayo ay bibigyan ko ng lunas. Let us pray, dear brothers and sisters, that the Lord will strengthen us. Strengthen us in our faith in the Lord, especially during this time of this very, very difficult situation of this pandemic. Amen.